We understand that these are confusing times as we deal with a pandemic the likes of which we haven't seen in our generation. There will be lots of people who are scared and feeling vulnerable and worrying how they are going to cope. While we can't predict what's going to happen and the situation is changing day by day, we want to reassure everyone that we're working hard to maintain council services to look after those who are most vulnerable. We have been preparing for this virus arriving in Fife. Our services have been working hard to identify those in our communities who are most vulnerable. We will make sure that they continue to get the support they need. For the rest of Fife, there will be many changes to our services uh, that you receive in the coming weeks as we prioritise staff and resources towards the most critical services. Our staff are under incredible pressure and they themselves are not immune to the virus. We need you to be patient and as a society we have to look after those who are most in need first. We can see how our community is already pulling together at this time. We and our third sector partners are being inundated with offers to help. We are very grateful for all these and in the coming weeks and days, we will be looking at how, where and when we can best use that support. For those who are already struggling financially through the minimum wage, jobs, zero hours contracts, unemployment, and for those who are self-employed or contract workers, we understand that there is a significant level of anxiety. We're going to be flexible with council tax and rent payments, allowing people to reduce or defer them depending on individual circumstances. Many businesses will be particularly hit in the coming weeks. We are working very hard to find a way to support people financially through these very difficult times. As soon as we have more detail, we will update you. We want to finish by asking everyone in the local community to look out for each other. Follow the guidelines coming from the government and all public health advice and do what you can to keep yourselves and others safe.